NSFW, what surprised you about sex after having it for the first time? That my core isn't as strong as I thought it was. I call that the beep muscles because you're using an entire new group of muscles edit, please. I don't want to hear about your sexual experience with these muscles. That was the only thing that I could say after my first time. My beep muscle really beep beep hurts. The girl's mother trying to barge in. The door was blocked by a dresser and her gaze beamed into the room like the the eye of Sauron. You shall not asterisk asterisk asterisk. Unbeep ring to rule them all. All the weird noises. Sorry, I don't know why I sound like a beached whale giving birth when I asterisk asterisk asterisk. It's just my thing I guess. Now all I can think of is finding Nemo. Holy asterisk 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 asterisk. If I'm going to do more of this, I need to get in shape. Oh yeah, cramps in your legs, no stamina, short breath, that was a variety, literally but yeah. Given all the joking about premature ejaculation, I was surprised with how long I lasted. This is pretty much the only one I'm on the same page with. I hear all these jokes about lasting like 30 seconds and totally went into it expecting that sort of outcome. Usually it doesn't happen every time. Just random times when you get too into it too quickly. The women also don't sit around looking at you side-eyed and disappointed like in the movies. I was surprised that although Beep felt better, masturbation gets the climax much faster. That's the most relieving thing here. How hard it was to keep your erection when you have to run upstairs and find a condom and then try to put it on really fast. How soon were her parents coming home? It was my place and we were alone. I just wanted to hurry up and do it. I thought I'd feel him beep inside me but I didn't. Really tried focusing every time to see if I'd feel anything at all, but no. Oh yeah and I can't finish with just penetration that part was annoying. Fun but annoying. Most women need clitoral stimulation to reach beep beep. You are not an outlier. It is quite funny how our culture always fails to mention this and it leads to a lot of women not coming and faking their beep to make men happy because they feel like they should be coming with penetration. Also, they might never beep well with a partner because of this, as they never learn how to make a her beep, which contributes to the beep beep gap between men and women. It was so warm in there. Yes it is. How my life was exactly the same. I still cringe when I think back to 16 year old me. Girl I had a crush on lost her virginity to a friend at a party. I wasn't there, and knowing that I had a crush on her, everyone was careful to keep that information away from me. When I found out I took it personally, noticed a bunch of not so nice stuff about her personality, and blamed it on how she'd changed after losing her virginity. I lost mine a few years later. Nothing changed for me at all. I looked back and realized nothing had changed for her either. All that happened was my own jealousy forced my rose-tinted glasses away, and my crush was just a fickle infatuation that had little to do with who she was as a person. To this day nearly years later, it's still something I think about and feel embarrassed over. Usually late at night, when I'm trying to sleep. I wish I could go back and tell my pre-high school self how little everything mattered. I thought my world was ending at 16 and here I am at 26 not even remembering those people's names. How difficult it was to climax in the presence of another person. I'd had almost a decade of practice only doing it when alone. Oh script, I got better, and I'm grateful to everyone who helped. I was like beep that is actually a lot of work it made me understand Charles Barkley's quote when talking about NBA teams playing three nights in a row, I wouldn't even want to have beep three nights in a row. When you're younger, beep three nights in a row is easy. As you get older and have less energy, it gets harder and harder to fit three consecutive nights of beep around your wanking schedule. That apparently I have a condition known as delayed ejaculation, or retarded ejaculation. Simply put it is very difficult for me to have a beep during asterisk asterisk asterisk. AKA I just kind of keep going at it for a long time. You would think that would be a good thing. Women complain about men not lasting long enough, etc. Instead my first partner literally stormed out of my dorm room in a fit of rage because I clearly wasn't interested in her and definitely not a virgin. Both of which I was until then. Same. I don't think this is a topic that's often discussed, but if I had a penny for every time I faked and beeped just to avoid hurting her feelings. I mean, you hear about the inverse a lot, but a lot of women feel like there's either something something wrong with you or with them if they can't make you beep. 
Guys are supposed to beep really fast or you're not hot enough or not doing well enough. Stuff like that. So, I faked a fair few beep asterisk after realizing I probably wouldn't be coming tonight. Nobody's fault really. Yup. Anytime I've talked about this with friends they act like I'm the luckiest guy in the world. But having to fake and beep doesn't feel great. Also, lost a relationship due in part to being caught on a fake beep and her not thinking I found her, attractive. Fun times. She wasn't a virgin. I was. I thought she was farting. I found that out when it happened again a week later and she said, You do know I'm not farting, right? I pretended I didn't googled it afterwards. My high school GF didn't know what it was either and said, Wait, that's not even coming from where it's supposed to. Beeper like, super warm inside. 6F. Nah dude it much much hotter than that. At least 98. 8F. This post just explained a lot of very angry jabbing above my asterisk 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 asterisk. You guys think it's higher than it is. The whole thing makes sense now. I thought maybe mine had an odd angle or something. I can't stop laughing. Yes when you're a dumb teen you think everything is neat and even. If beep is at this height then beep asterisk asterisk must be too, right? Well, no. As a woman I had opposite experience. I guess I thought penises would just dangle on the bottom like where the beep is and I was very surprised that it's so high up. Surprised someone wanted to sleep with me. For real, as a teenager I thought I was going to be some kind of 40 year old virgin because I was so awkward around girls. But I've somehow gotten a few different girls to sleep with me over the years and I'm now married, with three kids. So I guess some chicker and to beep with an awkward geek. What did you do different than a 40 year old virgin? For me, I think it was how natural it was. Like animal instincts kick in and your pelvis starts moving in whole new ways. It sounds like you have a good relationship with your instincts. Or a haunted pelvis. I knew that beep got hard, but I didn't expect it to be that hard. And yet the tip is still nice and squishy. That was just something I discovered with my hands. Also that penetration can feel good. When I experimented with my fingers or toys previous to having asterisk asterisk asterisk, it wasn't painful, but I didn't get any enjoyment out of it. After being penetrated with real beep, I discovered it was actually very pleasurable. Hey the reddit gods have mercy on your DMs. Are. Are people on this site seriously that messed up? Edit, I really meant this to be a little more sarcastic than it came off. I mean, my comment history alone proves I know how awful people are lol. I do appreciate everyone taking the time to be nice though smiley face. How shallow people can be. It was with one of my closest friends at the time and they never spoke to me again. I probably should have read the second sentence before trying to process this. That it wasn't some life-changing event. I didn't feel any different, af different afterwards except kinda proud for a day or two. I remember when one of my good friends in high school lost their virginity. Everybody in our friend group was praising him and he was acting all grown up in asterisk 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 asterisk. I wanted to tell them I had got some too but it was one of their sisters. Should've pulled the classic, she goes to another school. How deep exhausting it is. Same. It's all fun, but once I've climaxed I could sleep for 30 years. It's a lot of constant movement and holding yourself in weird positions, it takes endurance. Needing my asthma inhaler. At least he took your breath away. That'd be a she. And I guess kinda. Or I am, was just really out of shape. Foreplay was awesome, everything was exciting even if the dude was bad at it, being touched in any way was so stimulating because it never happened. The actual act though. I didn't feel anything. It like I didn't have anything in there, it was disappointing. Beep would have you believe otherwise but the key to female pleasure is the clitoris how easy it is for someone not to care afterwards. F. That I was not pregnant as my public school beep had had implied I would be. I was worried after my first time. Two months drifted by without even the slightest sign of my period. Then remembered I'm a dude. That was definitely it. My first time was somewhat late in life. I was 24. She was aware I was a virgin and I guess I'd have to describe it as her guiding me. My surprise was how great it was and how big of an ego boost it was. I'd watch Beep but didn't expect like that so I didn't really have any misconceptions. We just clicked really well and everything went smoothly. 
I got a boost in confidence and it felt like a relief in a way. For me, I had waited to be with the right woman. I had opportunities with women in the past but knew they wouldn't work long term, not religious or anything. Just knew what I wanted. She and I are married now, almost 10 years, and I wouldn't change a thing. Condoms taste like asterisk 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 asterisk. Especially if your partner just performed anal on you right beforehand. Bruh that asterisk 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 asterisk. Thinks I hate it. Well, I waited 19 years to get nailed in the back of some dude's car next to his piles of dirty laundry. It felt like nothing, absolutely no pleasure for me. But I did discover that I am very allergic to latex. That was a big surprise. Latex allergies is the most horrific thing in the world. It's like a blowtorch to your most important region. Skin condoms are a blessing. I didn't know I was allergic to latex for some years. And I had been using latex condoms for some years. For me it felt like sandpaper down there in extreme discomfort. Then I found skin condoms. LOL. Where the beep hole is it was a lot lower down than I expected. I can remember foreplay with my ex the night before and I was like rubbing her groin kind of area, where a dude's beep would be with my hands thinking it would be turning her on. I'd watched beep before but never thought about it eventually she showed me and I was quite embarrassed, didn't matter though had beep and lost my-